Hey guys, it's Heather. I'm here to do a tutorial on a mixed media canvas art. I'm going to show you what Bella and I created for her grandma for her birthday. So let's get right to it. So the first thing that you're going to need is a 12 by 12 canvas. And then you're going to flip it upside down and we're going to be creating on the back part of it. So you're going to need to get some gesso. And in my jar, I have golden gesso, but any type of white gesso will do. And you're going to put a coat of gesso all over the, this part of the canvas. In the middle and on all four sides. So the next step is you want the gesso to be completely dry. You're going to get out a stencil of your choice and some texture paste. And I'm going to do stencil all around the frame with the texture paste. And then you want that layer to be dry. And then what I've done is I've taken some paper towel and put in the middle part so that the inks that I'm about to spray don't get into the middle part of the canvas. And then you want to have a box, of course, and stick your canvas inside the box. And then I'm spraying a little bit of water and I'm going to do some different distress inks. I'm using a vintage photo. I think it's called Wilted Violet. I'm not sure, but I will have it in the description box. And then a yellow color. Here it is all dry. And I've done a, a coat of gesso on the inside frame and on the outside of the frame. I didn't film that. It's kind of boring part but it's just one coat of black gesso on the outside of the frame and on the inside. So now I'm taking some art glitter glue and I'm just kind of going, um, following my little pattern. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lay some gold leaf on top of that. And this is actually the first time I've ever tried it with art glitter glue and it worked out pretty good. doing is I'm laying that gold leaf down and then I'm just letting it sit there until that glue dries.
Then I have a little brush and I'm just lightly kind of going over it and knocking off the rest of the gold leaf. And this is what it looks like. Is that not gorgeous? So the art glitter glue worked really well. So the next step is I'm getting out my Mod Podge and I'm going to lay down a napkin in the center of my frame. And then you want to make sure that the, the layer where your napkin is is really dry and then you're going to get out your focal point which is this picture of Bella Ann and I'm going to lay that down with some Fabri-Tac glue. Okay, so the next step is, is I have all different types of flowers and I'm going to get out my hot glue gun and I'm going to glue all these different elements down to kind of make it look like Bella standing in like a bunch of wildflowers. And then I also have some Tim Holtz butterflies that I've put some gold leaf on and um, little rhinestones that I'm embellishing the piece with. And here is the final piece. I think it turned out really, really pretty. It's got that 3D kind of look. Bella gave it to her grandma for her birthday and she absolutely loved it. So this is a fun um, thing that you can make for a gift for somebody that you love. I hope that this has inspired you to create a piece of canvas art. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I hope that you will for future art videos. And please don't forget to hit the bell for my future uploads. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.